Well, my slogan is, at my age, if it's not fun, I don't need to be doing it. And that's just what AARP is about. <laughs> I'm Gary Adkins, as you know, and it's my great honor to join with you today here to recognize the commitment and leadership of our AARP Kentucky Volunteer State President, Charlotte Whitaker. Now, Charlotte is a dedicated champion of the 50 plus in Kentucky. As the AARP Kentucky Volunteer State President, she's brought a steady and thoughtful hand leading AARP's Kentucky service for our Executive Council, our volunteers, and our members. Her devotion to AARP's mission has been resolute through the good times, the challenging times, and certainly those times of uncertainty. Charlotte's a beacon for the 50 plus empowering Kentuckians to live their best lives, one county at a time. Her countless hours volunteering has changed lives in Kentucky for the better. She has friends and colleagues across all parts of Kentucky, and her reach extends far beyond the borders of her home in Ohio County. She's helped secure AARP Community Challenge Grants for Idle Hour Park, collaborated with the Bluegrass Area Agency on Aging to make Fayette County more age-friendly. With Mary Lynn, she facilitated a mayoral candidate forum, supported local female veterans and National Association for Black Veterans Lexington Chapter. And she's been a longtime supporter of the Lexington AARP Chapter and the Lexington Senior Center. Her grassroots advocacy, both in Washington, D.C. and in Frankfurt, have successfully supported lowering prescription drug prices for diabetes, delivering enhanced home and community-based services, basic social services, protecting consumers from fraud, abuse, and exploitation. When members of Congress were talking about deficit reduction, Charlotte was there pushing to protect Medicare, and social security benefits for Kentuckians. Charlotte, with the, the steady support of Gerald, has continued advocating and visiting Kentucky age-friendly communities, senior centers, and community groups, facilitating conversations about veterans, AARP Fraud Watch Network, caregiving, and the future of Medicare and Social Security. Today, every day, we're proud to recognize Charlotte's extraordinary volunteer leadership and commitment which embodies what AARP founder and our first volunteer, Dr. Ethel Percy Andrus, called the new image of aging and service to others. Charlotte, thank you so much. Hello, Charlotte. I just wanted to take a moment to give you our heartfelt thanks for all that you've done for AARP Kentucky. The legacy that you have left will be lasting for years and years to come. You are a true champion for the 50 plus population and AARP Kentucky is much better because of you. Thank you, my friend.